support engineer here at the AWS office in Dublin. Today, I'm going to show you why the emails that you send through Amazon's simple email service are not being delivered and what you can do to find out what's preventing their delivery. Let's get started. To identify and resolve what's preventing your emails from delivery, you must check a couple of things. Let's go through each of them. First, template rendering failure. If you send incorrect template data when you send emails using the send templated email API operation, then you might get a rendering failure event similar to this one. To identify this type of failure, you must set up rendering failure event notifications using Amazon Sample Notification Service by following the steps mentioned in Amazon SES documentation. You can find it linked in the Associated Knowledge Center article. Next, issues with the recipient email address. Your emails might not be delivered because there is a problem with the recipient email address that results in a bounce. Your emails can result in a bounce if the email address does not exist, the recipient's mailbox is full, your sending domain has a poor repetition, or your sending IP address has a poor repetition. Additionally, your emails might not be delivered because the recipient email address is either on your account suppression list or the Amazon SES global suppression list. To remove an email address from your account suppression list, refer to the steps mentioned in SES documentation. You can find this link in the Associated Knowledge Center article. Next, check whether there is an issue with the email recipient server. To determine if there is an issue with the email recipient server that's preventing your emails from getting delivered, you can set up Amazon SNS notifications for your Amazon SES emails by following the steps mentioned in SES documentation. Then, in the Amazon SNS notifications, review the SMTP response that Amazon SES returns. The SMTP response in the Amazon SES returned notification will be similar to this notification. You can also refer to the SES documentation under Amazon SNS notification contents for Amazon SES for more information on the details included in the SNS notifications. If Amazon SES receives an SMTP 250 OK response from the recipient SMTP server, that means Amazon SES has successfully sent the message to that mail server. However, the SMTP 200 OK response does not guarantee that the message is delivered to the receiving email address. Each email service provider determines whether the email is accepted, rejected, or classified. After Amazon SES delivers a message to the recipient server, the recipient server's policies determine whether to deliver the message to an inbox or spam folder or to reject the message entirely. Additionally, the recipient server might be experiencing a problem that results in the email not getting stored on the receiver's mailbox. Your email is labeled as a spam. Recipient email servers can filter your emails as a spam for several reasons, such as email authentication failures related to domain-based message authentication reporting and conformance, or DMARC, sender policy framework, or SPF, or domain keys identified mails, or DKIM. Or if you have issues with email content quality or sender repetition. If your emails are labeled as a spam, then it's a best practice to follow the steps outlined in the article 
linked in the Associated Knowledge Center article. This article will help you identify the reasons that your emails are labeled as a spam and that prevents this from impacting your email delivery. Next, if there is a sending delay, instead of your email not getting delivered at all, there might be a delay in the process of sending your email. In this case, you must identify where your email is delayed by following the steps in the article also linked in the Associated Knowledge Center article. You can use this information to identify whether your emails are delayed before arriving at SES, inside SES, or after leaving SES. And finally, if there is an ongoing issue with Amazon SES service that affects your email delivery, you can confirm this by reviewing the AWS Service Help Dashboard to check for any known issue with Amazon SES service that's preventing the successful delivery of your email. See the dashboard here, or by checking the status at the URL listed here. And now you know how to troubleshoot the reasons why the emails that you send through Amazon Symbol email service are not being delivered, and what you can do to find out what's preventing their delivery. Thanks for watching, and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.